Andy, congratulations, champions again. Thank you very much. Yeah, no, it's good. It was a, uh, a bit of a roller coaster there in the second half, but um, look, just delighted that we we, we kept playing, um, and it you know it stood to us on the end. Although there were a few uh, a few furry moments, to be fair, you know. You look home and hosed at half time, but uh, Corcon never let you get away with it. Yeah, no, to be honest, we knew Con would come back. There's huge pride in their dressing room, as always. So we knew they're going to come back at us, but uh, I have to be honest, I didn't quite pick they were uh, going to come as close as they did. So um, yeah, look, it was a uh, yeah, like I say, it gave us for some. Um, you know, some tight moments towards the end, but just pleased that the lads kept playing, back their, back their ability, and uh, that's what got us over the line at the end, you know. A man of the match performance from Joey Carberry, but it really was a team day, wasn't it? Yeah, no, I, th I think the back row in, in particular played seriously well, like Carl Moran, um, Tony Ryan, um, and Mick Noon all, all performed really well on the back of a very solid tight five, you know. We knew they were going to come us in that area, so look, you, you can't fault anyone in the pack. And then it's quite clear how, how our backline played and our strike runners, you know, they, they created some simply outstanding tries, you know, off the back of some pretty good work up front. So, yeah, pretty pleased overall. But, yep, Joey, yeah, he had an outstanding game. You know, there's, there's no getting away from that, like, I you know, he's there for all to see. Celebrations in the bull ring tonight? Uh, I'd say there probably will be. It might be, uh, might be one or two quiets uh, being partaken, without a doubt, Barry. Yep. Andy, congratulations.